The first is the shawl element that takes the line that develops off the front of the grill, comes rearwards into the waist rail before then enveloping the two occupants and cosseting them. This provides the level of romance, the level of intimacy that one would expect with a two-seater proposition. Secondly, you can see the center console plinth, this beautiful elliptical element that is more akin to what you would expect to find in an architectural space rather than in an automotive one. And this element sits high, again giving the impression that the occupants are deep down and protected within the cabin space. And the final gesture is, of course, the instrument panel, reflecting the materials and the colors of La Rose Noir, in particular, the inclusion of the red accent together with the high precision metalwork, but as a first for us, also the incorporation of the parquetry into the center needle coins of the dials themselves. By way of the client's request, we work together with Audemars Piguet to produce and integrate one of their unique high complication timepieces into the fascia panel of the car itself. But moreover, fulfill the exacting wishes from the client that it should also be wearable on the wrist. Now, when the client is to enter the car, they can then remove the timepiece and place it into the clasp holder here, where it will retreat back into the instrument panel and the straps can be stowed separately. And then, of course, to the real showpiece of La Rose Noir. The simple request from the client was to create the impression of floating roses as if they had been scattered across the interior by hand. Here, there's this beautiful merger between the tried and tested techniques of an age-old practice of parquetry with an achingly modern design that represents an abstract depiction of the rose petals these triangle elements are made up of 1,603 individual pieces. It took three years to move from the formative development through to the production of the piece that you see in here. Now, this highly contemporary depiction of the rose petals is not just exclusive to the interior. We actually bring the theme out onto the aft deck here. Now, interestingly, we execute it with a completely different technology, pulling on the very best skills within our paint area. Here, the artisans depicted 96 individual rose petals, executed in the true love paint that we find on the main flanks of the car, building on the foundation of the mystery base layer. But more interestingly, they're all hand stenciled and hand sprayed, but done so in a way, as the client insisted, that there could be no visible detection between the surfaces to understand that they had been applied by hand. With the roof fitted, Drop tail has transformed from a lithe open top roadster into a dramatic and formidable looking coupe. Here as a design team, we actually studied 1930s hot rods from the West Coast to appreciate the generous body side section to the very shallow glass proportion in here, together with the fast and accelerating roof line here. This was actually a feature that the commissioning client of La Rose Noir drop tail pushed us further with to really exaggerate the speed and the length of the line work, pulling it as far rearward as it could possibly go before truncating it here at the rear, mimicking the treatment of the cap roofs on 1920s Rolls-Royce Roadsters. And here we pioneered a large application of glass, a beautiful uninterrupted and rather pure treatment here that sits across the entire upper surface of the roof itself. Now, while that is impressive, the real ingenuity is that it incorporates electrochromatic technology, allowing the client at the touch of a button to transform from an opaque sun-shaded protection to complete translucency, taking in the view up and out of the cabin of the car. Our contemporary movement of coach build is about creating something artful that has real meaning. La Rose Noir drop tail is glamour distilled imbuing the personal passions and distinctly bold visions of the commissioning couple. And it is all the more extraordinary for it. It is an elevated statement of true connoisseurship, 